Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for watching. So I did not film an intro prior to this video, so I'm doing it after the fact because I wasn't sure I was gonna hit the jackpot at Walmart today. I went to a different Walmart shopped in store for home decor and I was absolutely floored. If you are in the Greenville Spartanburg area, I actually went to a Walmart I haven't been to in years. It's in Greer on Wade Hampton. Oh my gosh, I was so impressed. It was so clean. They had tons of stock, lots of really good home decor. So everything I am talking about, I'm gonna still link below for you guys to shop. Of course, you know, if you're not in the Greenville Spartanburg area or you don't have a Walmart, like tons of our other Walmarts are not this nice. So everything I will have it linked in the description bar below because of course you can buy online. I prefer to shop online with Walmart anyway. Um, but it is just so good. The home decor is adorable for fall. I picked up some really cute stuff and then some things I like already have. So it's a really good one today. Make sure to go below and click the subscribe button if you're new here. Follow me on other social media channels for more Walmart content and let's go ahead and get started. Look how pretty these are. Look how pretty these are. It's a serving board. Yep. Oh, look, that's for a charcuterie board. Is that glass? Covered tray set. Hmm. Where's the price on that one? Ten dollars. Ooh, this is pretty. Cake stand. This is really cute, too. Serving set. It has four poor little galvanized bowls ten dollars these baskets little two-piece set is ten dollars got a few different prints pioneer woman stuff is so cute pioneer woman was a cup kayla got me for christmas and we have some of their bowls and they are so nice Okay, so I actually have this at my house and I love it. The quality is like, I got it before Daniel's wedding. So I've had it for over a year and a half, $28. So I'm so glad we came to this Walmart. They have much cuter stuff than our Walmart does. You guys, the pillow section here this year is so nice. These are really pretty too, I like the blue. I love that. These are cute for fall. Hmm. That mirror is super nice, and so is that one. I love the frame to this one, though. Lots of good frame mirrors. Love that one. Okay, I'm definitely getting this one, and they have a smaller size, too. I think I'm gonna get that one as well. Love that. I just got a spout. Yeah. And it's glass. Pioneer Woman stuff is super, and I really, I have a set of bowls like this that my sister-in-law got me, and they are such good quality bowls, and these have lids. Eight pieces, so there's four bowls, four lids. $12. Hey. How cute all this stuff is. is. Why you look at the I mean, how adorable is that? Still considering getting, look at these. But see, the thing is, if you don't get something like that, I know. This is why I bring you shopping. Look at, oh my gosh. Okay, wait, hold on. That's not supposed to be in there. It's supposed to be wrapped. Look at how adorable that is. I mean, I feel like it's calling me. $15. Me and mom are like, we're losing it. And this is a set. I was gonna say, this is two, I think. The only thing is I wish they had lids. If they had lids, I would buy these two right Look now and get rid of two. I know. It. Yeah, it's a, uh, I think it's that same pattern as that one. Take all of my money, all of it. You can literally have all of it. Oh my gosh, I've got to stop. I don't need this stuff yet. I don't have the room for this stuff yet, but I will soon. Okay, so you can buy the individual pieces or you can buy the sets. How cute, but the set of this one sold out. What is that? And then all this stuff's really cute too. So I have this on my table right now. These are super nice. I have something like that from Target already. Oh my gosh. I had an outdoor area. I love that. 
I actually might get this from my house too. Will you grab me one? <laughs> Look at the they're not easy to find. No, they're not. I not mean, good the, the ones, rust. too. So there was a ton of good stuff. My mom got some things. Um, again, I don't usually shop Walmart in-store because I just don't have good luck. I feel like, at least up until today, my Walmart's just around here. Like, that's the first Walmart around here that we have that is nice. And I told my mom, I was like, the manager for this place needs a raise. So I want to show you some of the non-home decor related stuff that I did buy because I do have another Walmart video coming. I'm hoping that it will be like Monday or Saturday. A couple of the pieces don't get in until later this week, but I do want to share a sneak peek of some of the fashion items. Um, and the reason I'm not doing a try on haul is because if you're new here or you like just haven't caught up with my videos, I wash and dry everything before I share it with you guys so that I can share how it kind of holds up in the washer. Um, so you don't, you know, whether you need to baby something or not, because I would rather, you know, me ruin something and be able to relay that message rather than you guys spend your money on something and, and ruin it. So first and foremost, I bought these athletic shorts. The sizing on these looks way off i usually don't feel like the sizing is off um maybe it's just this brand no athletic works so this is the athletic works brand i've never felt like their sizing is off but this is a small and even like the extra small did not look much different than that different than this but the medium looked huge and even my mom was like i guess i would wear an extra small in the ones that she got so these just look really comfy i feel like these would be good um athletic shorts or even like sleep shorts if you want to so this is actually kind of a repurchase i did buy this i think i got a large in the gray and i got an extra large in the green because this is just so cozy and i loved this they had like black i think blue red the green and then the gray at this walmart and i loved it and i don't know if i've said this i will put the address for the one that i went to if you are in greenville spartanburg i'll put it in the um, description bar below they had the green so i wanted to get the green color because i have worn the gray hoodie so much since getting it like I think I've worn it every day for the last like two weeks. And again, these will be coming in a try on haul, but I just wanna make sure I um, wash and dry them first. This shacket, which I actually have not even seen online, doesn't mean it's not there, it just means I haven't seen it, but um, plaid shacket, looks like it's gonna fit true to size. This is a medium, very, very soft. It's the time and true line. Usually their stuff does fit true to size, it just depends. This I got because last year, if you followed me through my pregnancy, you know I was all about the sweater vest trend and it was not something I thought I was gonna be about, but oh my gosh. So I got this in a large because they didn't have a medium and I felt like, at least in my opinion, I think the sweater vests just look better on me when they were bigger. You may be able to get your true size, but I feel like they looked just better on me in a larger size, so I got this one. It does have like this little detail all over the front. I don't really know what you would call it. I've never seen it, but the color's pretty. I think they had an off-white as well, um, but I really liked this like brown color. I was not expecting to love the sweater vest trend, but maybe it was just me being pregnant last year, but I absolutely loved it. And then this one. So I shared this in black the other day, and so I bought it in white, and I love it. This is another, it's like could be worn as a cardigan, could be worn as just a sweater itself. Got it in my true size medium. Um, really, really comfortable. The black one washed and dried well, but it did. I think that was the one that rubbed up against a lot of stuff in the washer and dryer and kind of peeled a little bit. So just be careful with that. But like I said, all this stuff, I will do a try on haul with you. And then also I did not know, maybe I'm just living under a rock because Hello Bello, um, we use their body wash for Ezra and it is so good because multiple times, especially now that he really likes to splash, he has gotten soap in his eye and he never cries. It never causes tears. Um, he usually just like wipes it out and then he keeps going. So I really like their products. When I saw they had the SPF 50 in the mineral sunscreen, um, I went ahead and picked this up. The pediatrician said now that he's four months old, we can put sunscreen on his hands, feet, and face. Of course, I recommend asking your pediatrician before putting sunscreen on your baby, but I have a ginger, so he needs sunscreen. Um, when we go outside for any extended period of time, even with like a hat and all that stuff, it just, you know, you can't fully protect him um, at all times. So I got this and we will put that on his hands, feet and face until he reaches six months when we will get the clearance to cover him in some sunscreen. Like I said, I got a little ginger boy, so I have to. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you liked this video a little bit different, but usually I don't have success shopping in stores. So I was very, very happy with this video today. Love y'all so much and I will see you in my next video.